Hello reformers and welcome back to Dark Souls. Now as you can see I am actually attempting to defeat this guy who has been a bane in our side for far too long in my opinion. So I am <laughs> hopefully going to take him out with my amazing lightning spears. As you can see it does quite a lot of damage in comparison to my melee attacks on him. So I'm thinking you need to use magic to actually do a lot of damage considering he's actually not doing that much to me from far away. So I'm very happy with that indeed. So hopefully we'll be able to get something very nice from him. Now, the last you saw me, I was in the Duke's archives and we will be returning there very shortly. But one of you told me in the comments that it would be a great idea. Ooh, Demon Titanite, very nice. It would be a good idea to head to Darkroot Basin and defeat a golem of some sort and that would enable me to gain an item from the blue golem in the Duke's archives to be able to access the new content that they unlocked with the latest part or should I say the PC version <laughs> of Dark Souls or at least I think it is PC exclusive. Is it PC exclusive? I don't think so but Yes, if it is, then there we are. <laughs> so, now, seeing as I'm going to make my way back to Darkroot Basin, I believe it is actually that way, not this way, so I'm just going to kill this, and I will cut away, so when we arrive, I will then cut back. Okay, so here we are. We have arrived at where we defeated the Hydra. Now, I believe this is actually the golem I was talking about at the time when I defeated the Hydra and for some reason it didn't spawn and you guys told me in the comments at the time that I needed to go back and reload the game and try to get it to spawn so here we are we're finally doing it so <laughs> hopefully it will appear very shortly or it will be here already maybe please oh yes there it is Ah, oh, yeah okay thank you very much for telling me about this to actually go back and get it so that we can access the new content. That would be really cool, indeed. If I can figure out how to use this to access the new content, that is. <laughs> yes, okay, so let's do it. Now, I am in water, so it's going to reduce my movement speed by a considerable amount, as you can see. So let's hope this guy doesn't do much damage, and he doesn't seem to at the moment. Okay, not bad. Oh, that was a bad idea for me to do that. Okay. Okay, yes, I think I may be a little bit too powerful for this guy. Ooh, that was a bit of a stronger hit from him there. Okay, come on. There we go. One more hit, I think, will do it. Oh, yes. And there we go. Oh, yes. Very nice indeed. Oh, my. What is this? Hello. <laughs> okay. I suppose we speak. Oh, we do. Okay. She's like a statue. Okay, so let us talk. So, it is thou who rescueth me. Most gracious, I am deeply obliged. I am Dusk of Ulysseel. I cometh from an age long before thine. I cannot stay here for long. So, before I disappear, allow me to ask one thing. My home, Ulysseel is the home of ancient sorceries. My hope is to pass this profound knowledge to thee with thine approval. Would this be of assistance to thee? My heartfelt thanks. I am pleased beyond words. Then I shout, engrave my signature. If thou art in need, pray summon me from my signature. It seems that my time is done. May the great flames guide thee. Okay, so I suppose she will be around here somewhere that we can actually speak to her once again and she can potentially give us the item. I don't know actually what we need to access the new content. I do apologize. I don't actually do much research on this as I don't want to give myself spoilers. And yes, so... Hopefully we'll be able to find her somewhere around here. I'm thinking she's going to probably be by the waterfall because that is rather stunning, to say the least. But if not, then I may just have to look around 
the lake in particular. Or maybe she's back there and I missed her sign? I, I don't know. Well, we're just going to check real fast. I will actually cut away very fast indeed, and once I found her sign, I will cut back. Aha, okay, so I think I have spied it, and it appears to be over here. Now, I do actually realize now, I was just thinking as I was going across the water there, that I actually need the item from the blue golem in the Duke's archives, not from Dusk herself. So I do apologize for my absolutely terrible memory. Now, is this actually her sign? I don't actually want to summon anyone apart from her, so... Well, let's do it. Ah, it is her. I am Dusk of Ulysseo. It is an honor to see thee again. I shall follow thy wishes. Aha! Oh my goodness. Okay, she is a merchant. Very nice indeed. Okay, let's learn the gesture. Proper bow. Ooh, very nice. Gesture learned. Very nice. Okay. Purchase. Oh my goodness. Thankfully. I have enough souls to actually buy one of these, but I don't actually have the intellect required for it. So, <laughs> it's not exactly the greatest, I suppose. Although, she sells a staff. I'm going to buy that, just because, you know, why not? Let's go for cast light as well. And what does Chameleon do? Let's take a look. Transform into something inconspicuous, a separate stealth spell from Hidden Body. A skilled stealth sorcerer must be aware of his or her surroundings, and of which objects are prime candidates for imitation. Aha! Okay, well, that only has one use, and it is quite expensive. I think I would like to get Hidden Weapon, although I am never going to level up my intellect, I don't think, on this character at least. So, yeah, I think we'll go for Hidden Body as well. And I think I will leave the rest because she's going to be available for the whole time I would think so yeah that should be fine if thou art in need pray summon me again I only wish to be of some genuine assistance may the flames guide thee thank you very much Dusk oh yes okay so <laughs> I will be heading back to the Duke's archives and I will see you there okay so we are now here in the Duke's archives and as you can see Everyone is dead around me, yes. Okay, so we will be killing the blue golem right now. And hopefully he will be dropping the item that we require. Yes, he is rather hardy, isn't he? Quite tough to defeat. Oh my, and he actually does quite a lot of damage. <laughs> oh my, okay. I think he was a lot easier before. Or is that just my imagination? Okay, there we go taking him down and there we are we get a broken pendant so I would assume what you need to do is then head to dusk maybe and speak to her and then that triggers some sort of event that brings you to the new content well please correct me if I'm wrong in the comments of course and yes then we will see in the next episode what we can do with that but for now I will be heading to that fog door or misty door and we will see what is beyond it. I know some of you have actually said that there is a boss beyond it. So I'm thankful that I leveled up beforehand. So I will be on my way right now. And I will see you there. Okay, so here we are at the Misty Door. And a few of you have actually said that I need to use a Ring of Sacrifice. Now, I'm going to take off Havel's Ring for this. Because it doesn't break, obviously, when I take it off. But here we are, Ring of Sacrifice. Now, we lose nothing upon death. Now, I'm not planning on dying, but I guess you guys know more than I do about this, so I'm going to trust you, yes. So let's see what we can do when we step through the door. Oh, yes. Oh, okay, so it is a boss. Oh, well, I thought so from your comments. Thank you very much about that. And now, let us battle him and hopefully not get completely massacred. Although, how am I supposed to get to him? <laughs> There's actually no way for me to get to him at all. Is there? Okay, well, I'm going to use my lightning spears. Let's do it. Okay, I damaged him, but he doesn't appear to die. Okay. Oh. 
Okay, that must be why you guys told me to <laughs> use the ring. Thank you very much. Oh my, yes. I don't know how I'm going to beat that guy. I suppose this is rather scripted. I would think it probably is due to the fact that we're in a different place now and not back at the original bonfire. So yes, Ring of Sacrifice is shattered. Yes, thank you very much, I know. But we do have two of them, so that's not too bad. Now, we want to... Oh my, find my other ring. Where is it? There it is. Hello, Havel's ring. Very nice. Okay, so we are now ready to proceed, I suppose. I did actually do 327 damage to him <laughs> with my lightning spear. Of course, that doesn't actually do anything, considering... I think he is not even killable at that point, which is rather disappointing. But I suppose they wanted us to be in jail. I think this is jail. Looks like jail to me. And take out these guys. Thank you very much. And... Oh my. Okay, so... Open? Oh. <laughs> yes, of course, it's not that easy. Yeah, it's not that easy at all. Okay, so I guess we're going to light this bonfire. That might be a good idea, wouldn't it? Okay, and rest. And it's not kindled, of course. Oh, well, I guess we might as well repair. And then we will see about getting out of here. How do we open this? Oh, there's actually a guy right here. Can I kill this guy from here? <laughs> Let's try it. Oh my god, really? <laughs> okay, well, apparently you can, and you get the key from it. Oh, wow, well, that's convenient, isn't it? How lovely. Okay, let us open the gate and escape. It's mini Cthulhu's. Oh, that is not a good idea. Okay, well, let's hope we can... Really? I was going to say, let's hope we can fight these guys off, but apparently they're just going to go right by me. Okay, they must be really scared of these tentacle monster things. Whoa, okay, they're pretty fast. Maybe I should be scared too, should I? Oh, but there might be items down here. Wait, I just want to check this gate down here. Quick! Run! Open it! Hello! Oh, okay. Don't thank me then. <laughs> oh no! Okay, so yes, let's hope we don't die, although we are quite close to our bonfire. Oh, nothing in here. Okay. Maybe it's not worth it then. Hello! Oh my! Okay, you might be rather aggressive. <laughs> Hello, how's it going? Okay. Lightning spear time. Let's do it. Yeah. Okay, they die in one hit? Really? Okay, so maybe I can just kill them very easily with my weapon. Any more? No. There's just one now, so let's do it. Come on. Okay. He shoots magic. And dies in one hit. I don't know why those guys were running. They do give a lot of souls, which is rather nice. Oh, they might have, like, a devouring attack of some sort, which would do a hell of a lot of damage. That might be the reason why. Okay. Not too bad so far, though. I just want to check all these gates down here for potential... Oh, really? I had a key. <laughs> oh, no. For potential items, I was going to say, yes. What about here? Is it just all going to be locked? Oh, no, no. We can get in here. Hello. Nice backstab going on there, and then we can take care of his friend as well, hopefully. Yes, okay. Items, give me the items. Ooh. Oh, there is actually an item down there. And a guy that I can kill with a plunging attack. Yes. Anyone else? No. Okay. Aha, archive prison extra key. Ooh, okay. Well, I suppose we need that for something. Oh my! Oh, whoa, that scared me. <laughs> that actually gave me a fright. 
Oh, I was not expecting him to be on the left side of me. Yes, that is a grabbing attack, isn't it? That most likely kills him one shot, I would assume. That is the only reason why these guys would be actually afraid of them. Should I actually even continue to going down here? Oh my. I would like to, but you never know. They are probably really dangerous. Uh, should I just go up? They kind of want me to go up, don't they? Rather than down. And I'm still continuing to go down, even though I've just said that. Yes, how wonderful. <laughs> okay, let's just be a little careful here. You never know what could potentially happen. And I just failed with my free aiming, of course. Okay, come on. I'm going to pull you guys. Come on, let's do it. Yes, yes, come over here. Oh my. Okay, you are rather vicious, aren't you? <laughs> Okay, whoa, okay. There we go, at least I killed two of them at once. And now we can take out the last one. I hope. No. Oh my, am I dead? I'm not dead. Okay, so it's not that brutal. Although it could be if I didn't have this much vitality, I suppose. So yes. <laughs> Thankfully, I do have quite a serious amount. And there we go. I will use an Estus Flask instead of using my Great Heal because... Great Heal heals the full amount of HP, which is absolutely amazing. And now, I'm going to check around here for any obvious secret passages. Yeah, there's no way there's going to be any obvious ones, of course. So, we're going to head out the front door, I think. Let us see. Okay, so we've got a few more of these. Oh, these are harder. Okay. These are a lot harder. <laughs> yes. Oh my. Okay. Chill. Okay, do they not attack? Miracle. Bountiful sunlight. Very nice. Okay, well, I might as well. And another one. Miracle. Soothing sunlight. Ooh, very nice. And this is locked. Oh, that's a shame. I wanted to get that item. But I suppose you can get it from another way, maybe? Hmm. I'm not too sure about that. Okay, well, seeing as we have entered prison and escaped prison in the same episode, I will probably end this off here. So, I thank you for watching, and I will see you next time.